Georgia is one of the areas that experienced a lot of storm damage today. There are trees down, roads closed, and houses badly damaged. Fox 5's Denise Dillon has a report. Phenomenal destruction. It looks like a bomb went off out there. Not a bomb, but a storm that was on a rampage as it barreled through Albany and Doherty County, knocking over trees, power lines, buildings, and homes. The damage so significant, many couldn't get out of their neighborhoods. Vanessa Jones and her family walked a mile and a half to get to the main road. I could hear the wind. It felt like it was on top of our house, so we ran into the restroom, and that's where we stayed until everything got calm. And then we was able to look out and see damage everywhere. Local officials say a mobile home park called Paradise Village took a direct hit. It literally looks like um, somebody took an entire trailer park and threw it across the street into the woods. You have people that are hurt. Uh, they're trying to find people right now. We have search and rescue teams out there looking for people. More than 100 first responders jumped into action. The damage devastating and widespread. As we were out doing search and rescue operations early on, we kept getting information about other neighborhoods that were hit and other neighborhoods that were hit and other parts of the county that were hit. And more video of storm damage out of Albany, Georgia, from Facebook user Zen Williams. He live streamed the damage as he walked through his neighborhood this afternoon. You can see trees down along with power lines and structures damaged. And take a look at this video out of Dakota, Georgia. Facebook user David Dorsey streamed this video of the damage done to his home and property. As you can see, he was hit hard. Well, the Red Cross is stepping in to help victims of severe weather here in Georgia. As communities in South Georgia and the Southeast prepare for the next wave of severe weather, the Red Cross has been deploying volunteers and stocking supplies at their shelter locations. Workers are also now in Adel County, where a tornado destroyed a mobile home community. Several people were killed. The Red Cross says they will be prepared to respond to emergencies for the next 24 hours. Now, if you don't already have it, now is the time to download the Fox 5 Storm Team weather app. There you'll find the latest forecast, live radar, and weather alerts any time of day. Download it for free from the Apple App Store or Google Play. Still